Tell Arteta breaks silence on Arsenal transfer issues with pointed message to board. Arsenal and Mikel Arteta have gone close for the past two years in the Premier League and their Spanish manager wants the support to go again if they want to be champions. Mikel Arteta insists he needs to upgrade his Arsenal squad if it is to be third time lucky for the Gunners. The Spaniard has gone close in the Premier League for the past two seasons, losing out to Manchester City on both occasions as the club's wait for a top-flight success extends beyond two decades. Arteta has been allowed to invest heavily, landing Declan Rice for a club record fee 12 months ago. The Arsenal boss wants the Emirates hierarchy to again pour more money into the playing group in an effort to end City's dominance of the Premier League. Arteta confessed the club need to improve across the board, suggesting that more depth is required. When quizzed on the need to upgrade his playing staff, Arteta said, We have to. Perfection in this league requires different standards. To relate that word perfection to winning the Premier League then that's what we have to do. We need to upgrade in everything we are doing. We have to improve in every area and that is what we are trying to do. Arteta has been able to overhaul the squad in North London, adding leading lights like Ben White, Rice, Martin Odegaard and Kai Havertz. Arsenal have posted huge points totals in recent seasons with their manager adamant they are close to finally achieving their goals, but isn't sure if he'll welcome new faces to aid those ambitions. He added, I don't know if anyone will join us. It's still a lot of time to go in the window but that's more of a question for ado and the board I think. When you are so close you want to grab it. We are very close. Arsenal have been linked with defensive recruits and a new face in the final third. The lack of a prolific frontman has been cited as an issue, hence them being linked with the likes of Alexander Isak and Ivan Toni. They're also thought to be among those pursuing Real Sociedad's Mikel Marino. Bologna's Ricardo Calafiori, who played for Italy at the Euros, is among those they want to bolster their defensive line but the deal continues to be held up. Negotiations are rumbling on and Arteta could give no timeline for Calafiori's potential arrival. No, unfortunately not but obviously we know there are certain positions that we want to improve and give the squad better resources in terms of numbers where we are short, he said. We will try our best but the main thing is to focus on falling in love with the players we have and make them better. Arsenal are currently in the midst of their preseason tour of America, where they will play Bournemouth, Manchester United and Liverpool. Their season begins with a clash against Wolves at the Emirates. Sky Sports News has been told another Premier League club, as well as Juventus and Real Madrid tried to sign the player in the last 10 days. 22-year-old defender starred for Italy at Euro 2024 after impressive season in Serie A. Italian club want, 42.1 million for centre-back. Arsenal are finalising a deal for Bologna defender Riccardo Calafiori for a fee expected to be worth a combined 42.1 million pound. Bologna have been holding out for that figure, and Sky Italy have reported discussions continue over a payment structure and clauses. There is agreement on many aspects of the deal at this point, but it is it still not fully done. Personal terms are not expected to be a problem. Calafiori's former club Basel stand to make 50% of Bologna's profit on any deal. Sky Sports News has been told another Premier League club, as well as Juventus and Real Madrid tried to sign the player in the last 10 days. However, Calafiori only wanted Arsenal and gave his word he would join the Gunners. His representative Alessandro Lucci from the World Soccer Agency worked with both clubs over the past month to ensure a deal would get done. The 22-year-old defender shown at Euro 2024 despite Italy's early exit in Germany, with his presence sorely missed through suspension in the then-holder's last 16 exit to Switzerland. Arsenal received Gabriel Jesus' transfer update as £50 million. Pounds pound. Agreement, reached. Latest Arsenal transfer news with an update on Gabriel Jesus giving Mikel Arteta a potentially major decision to make. Arsenal may be forced into making a huge Gabriel Jesus transfer decision this summer. The Brazil striker endured a challenging second season at Emirates Stadium following a bright debut campaign after joining the club from Manchester City in 2022 for £45 million. Though the goals have come, Injuries have been far more regular with Jesus plagued by three separate issues in the last 12 months. The 27-year-old still managed 16 goal contributions with excellent performances against Sevilla and Luton Town arriving in that time, however he still lost the starting striker spot to Kai Havertz. Injuries and changes in tactics from Mikel Arteta sometimes saw him deployed in the false nine role with Havertz dropping into midfield. However he was not in Arteta's preferred Arsenal starting 11 towards the end of the campaign. With that in mind, 
Mild exit links have emerged as some of the belief Arsenal have moved past he and Alexander Zinchenko in their project. With three years remaining on his contract, the Gunners would likely demand a considerable fee to let him depart and that could potentially be on the way. Saudi Pro League club Al Ali have Jesus on their list of potential striker targets alongside Tottenham's Rickarlson. There is no guarantee of course that Jesus will become their priority, however an offer could plausibly arrive in the next few weeks. In the last 12 months, the likes of Ruben Neves, Alexander Mitrovic and Fabinho have all completed lucrative moves from the Premier League to the Middle East with Musa Diaby looking set to join that list. As Aston Villa are still struggling to comply with financial rules, a marquee sale was needed alongside the exit of Douglas Luiz.